Hey guys, I'm the JY Effect, and welcome back to Ticket Skyblock. And, uh, I've been farming for a while, so much so it's becoming night time. But, while I was farming, I left this beautiful contraption on, I got myself a lot of cobblestone. And everything that I've just done is all gonna go straight into here. Besides maybe two stacks of cobble, they might prove useful. So, uh, what I'm doing is hopefully just getting myself a whole wodge of EMC. Yes, that's right, a wodge, if that makes sense. Fourteen and a half thousand. Holy schmokes. I should probably work on getting myself an energy condenser. Fuck it, we'll do that after, uh, this crap's done. And, uh... I thought there was some mob there, maybe not. Um, let's get this egg. What's it worth? 32? Hell yeah. But I'm not gonna do anything with it. I wanna keep it so I can get another chicken. Right, so let's get some of this stuff that I had last time. So, what do I have? I had normal rail powered holding and boarding Jesus Christ and I'm gonna need a lot of red alloy wire and let's make some more so four one two three four one two three four one two three four yeah okay so if I put this back in the alloy furnace we will hopefully be able to get another three bits of the red alloy wire, which I believe you just do that with. And you get another 12. I'm going to need a lot more than 25 because I need several, about one and a half stacks worth. So it looks like the gunpowder is going to redstone, but I'll leave one and maybe like five glowstone. But actually I can't do that yet because I've got all this stuff in here. So what I'm going to be doing with that is making that into iron. Because iron is something I desperately need. And I don't have enough for any more, do I? Let's track A. Eh? Left with one EMC. Um, let's have a bit of grass for the animals to munch on. Why not? Uh, there we go. Enjoy. Right, on to railcraft stuff. Let's take iron. Let's do something with it. I'm going to take a bit of wood, make some more redstone torches. Um, now I can put this stuff in. Let's, let's go for 5 and 10. Whoa, look at all this stuff we can get. Lava cells, uranium ore. Oh yeah, I'm playing with the version of Ticket that has uranium as 4,000, not like 49,000. I wish it was 49,000. Um, so really I just need redstone. That's enough redstone for me. Let's get some charcoal, because they do the same thing, but it's like four times less EMC than normal coal, so... And it's always useful, because you can just whack it in with this lot. We'll leave some in there. Let's leave five in there. Get some more aloe wire. Good. Coal's going back. Three redstone torches should do it for now. And now it's the elevator tracks that I am most concerned about. So it's seven iron to two redstone. Jesus, that's quite a lot. So that's that's sixty-four. And that's a whole stack of iron. Or near enough. Fuck. 
Right, let's let's sleep the night. I don't want to be out there with the mobs and stuff. In fact, is it still on? Yeah, it's still on normal. Awesome. All right, hello animals. How you doing? Um, damn it, I've forgotten the pig's name I was going to choose. That's annoying. Also, we need to name the chicken. Right. Um, do I need to make a minecart? I think I got one in the chest. So that works. That works. And then that works. That's good. But this has also got to be linked up with... I don't need the rails, so these can move out for a minute. So, oh, fucking repeaters. That's what I need. I need two repeaters. Ah, right then. Let, let's make these repeaters, shall we? Repeaters. Right, let's cook up some stone. Uh, normal furnace. Let's just do eight because that's one piece of coal. Right, there we go. Two redstone repeaters. They're quite a high EMC. I thought they'd be a bit lower than that. And I need a shortcut down here. But, oh, another e another egg. Awesomeness. Right then, I need some kind of safety rail. I feel like I'm going to fall off. Right, so the repeaters, the whole point of making them is we're going to have one there and one over here. And oh yeah, I forgot they stopped you from walking. Um, we need a block down over here then so I can get across. And the reason for doing that is this button is going to come over here and then it's going to change the state of the elevator tracks that are going to go down there. But there's also going to be one at the bottom in case I need to change it down there, which will send a signal up and then change the same T flip flop. So um, I'll do an explanation video of it. It's fairly complicated. So that signals the repeater good and then we want that down there and then two more on the top I just need the pistons now and then all should be sorted elevator tracks I need to get down and start placing them from the bottom because the cool thing with elevator tracks is you can go up them like a ladder Thing is, though, is can I make that jump into the water? <gasps> oh, yeah, okay. That was easier than I thought. Ooh, <laughs> I nearly screwed that up. Oh, hey, it's the nether portal. Let's make a little platform so we can build across. Not build across. I've already built across, so we can walk across. I I ought to do something with these ender chests. Maybe I could... I don't want anything in the nether. The only thing... Um, you'll see what I'm going to do in the nether. I'm not going to reveal that, because it's quite a cool idea. And I need to check the EMC values of stuff. You might guess it, you might not. Alright, I'm just going to build all the way up with these elevator rails. Ah, right, there we go. Beautiful. So, let's build a lever. And basically, I'm going to just quickly show how elevator rails work. So basically, when they are unpowered, uh, you will go down. So you will go straight down and end up at the bottom. 
but when they are powered, like this, you see the little red bit changes colour slightly, glows, that's when they're powered, so you go up. So, it, it kind of makes sense. You would have thought it just kind of, if you go from that side and it goes up, you go up, but it's a bit more sophisticated than that. So that is really a cool thing with uh, elevator rails. And I wonder if that's going to land on there. Huh. So, yeah, I love just using these as ladders. They're like, they're really good for when it's not fully set up yet. So... I can just kind of get down without dying, and in fact I don't think I need this water here anymore because I can just go down the rail. There it is, that piece of cobble. Because I, I really wanted that one piece of cobble. How much is end stone worth, or white stone? One. I might decorate stuff with that at some point, because that, that's, it looks like pretty cool, just because it looks different, and it's only worth one EMC, so it's ridiculously cheap. Right, I think that's going to do it. We've got the elevator rails, and we've started to get things a little bit more set up. In fact, I'm going to make the pistons. Let's extend this episode a bit. I'm going to make the pistons, and then show you guys how elevator rails properly work. But while I'm saying this, I'm just going to cut all of this out. <laughs> Right, one last thing before we end the episode, and that is, I'm going to make myself some pistons, and I'm going to show you guys how the T flip flop and stuff works. Another egg, my god, you are so generous. No one's eaten the grass yet. I think they're conserving it, they know it's the only piece of grass they're ever going to get. Unless I feel generous, which I don't. Yeah, it's reorganised things, it's a bit annoying. Pistons! Pistons, I'm going to need two. So... Uh, I think I've got everything I need. That's two pistons. And then... Just like that. And the good thing with this is they don't have to be sticky pistons, because there's two pushing against each other anyway. So... Even if they don't pull the block back, the other one's going to push it forward. So that's pretty darn awesome. I don't have to waste slime. So that one's done, that one's done. And then... So the way I'm going to be telling that uh, the rail is powered or not is just whether this redstone signal. Because what's going to happen is I'm going to push off from here. I'm going to go down. And then I'm going to stop here, because that's what the holding rail does. It stops you until it gets power. Then when it gets powered, it sends you in the direction you were going anyway. It can't send you the other way. So what's going to happen is I'm going to sit here and I'm going to look at that redstone line there and just see, is it powered or not? If it is powered, then I'm going to flip this switch so that it's not powered so that I can go down. But if it's in the state it is at the moment, I could just push this one, I would go again, and then because they're unpowered, I would be able to go down. But let's do this and just see if it powers it. Yeah, look, yes, it works. So they're now powered, which is really cool. So it shows that this works, and uh, there's just going to be another station, it's kind of station-ish. Just kind of making sure this is powered or not, I wouldn't really class it as a station, because there's nothing down there. But um, there's going to be another holding point, so I can convert that down at the bottom, and it's just going to be linked back up to this, where the other repeater is, in fact, via this line, which just goes down the back of the elevator track blocks. So that is really, really awesome. So yeah, thanks everyone for watching. See you next time for more Railcraft goodness. Hopefully be getting this middle bit done, and maybe the other side, but as you can see, I don't have many elevator tracks left. So yeah, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time. <laughs> uh.
leave your suggestions for the name of this chicken in that comment section. I'm fed up with I'm fed up with three animals already, and I want more, but I'm still fed up with these three. Right. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you all next episode, and uh, don't forget to leave your names for this delightful chicken, the one that is running away from me. Leave the names for that in the comments section. Thanks for watching.